Alright, what's going on everybody? It's Mini back with another Minecraft tutorial video. And in today's video guys, we're doing an automatic item sorter for uh, materials that stack to 64. So we have our items in this chest, we break that block, they're now going to start sorting, and the coal will go in here, the iron in there, and yeah, you get the point. The item frames correspond to what's going to be inside the chest. It'll automatically sort the blocks out, and it's pretty, it's a very expensive build. There's a lot of hoppers, it's more of an end game scenario when you're sick of losing stuff in your chest. It's, it costs a lot of iron to do this, but it is possible, and it's, it's pretty big. It's not very compact much, but that's uh, the most basic form of this. And if we check the chest, as you can see, the gold's in the gold, iron's in the iron, the coal's in the gold, you have the coal's in the coal, diamonds, and everything sorted out, and then all the junk went in here. So we have a junk chest as well, just to filter all the extra stuff through. But yeah, let's get into how to build it. Okay guys, so to start this build, you want to start by placing your chests. So these are going to be double chests, just to hold the most items possible. And I'm just going to mirror how many chests we have over there, even though you can expand this literally as long as you want. It just gets very expensive. So once you have your chest placed, you want to come right here and place a torch. Break this block and place torches on the sides of all these blocks like that. Then you want to go behind the torches and you want to place uh, repeaters going into that block just like that. Alright, now that you got that, what you want to do is you want to have hoppers going into all the chests like this. Make sure they're facing into the chests. Then you want to place some blocks right here. Just like that. And you want to take hoppers and place them going into those blocks. Make sure they're not going down. You want them going sideways like this into the block. If they're going down, this won't work. Just like that, all going into this block, and then when you break it, it should look something like this. Okay, and then what you want to do is you want to add the top layer of hoppers, so we can do it just like this. Place a block right there and have them going across into each other like this, so the items will travel across. And that's the entire hoppers. It's really expensive, but that's that's what you got to do. I mean, you could probably substitute water for transportation, but we'll just start with this. Okay, so then what you want to do is you want to get some reverse stairs. Just like this. This is the best way. You don't have to do this, but this is just how I make it look nice. Get some reverse stairs like that. And you can place some up here if you want. You can break that. And then you want to place your item frames over those stairs because you can still open the chest with stairs above it. And that, that will uh, show what you have, what block will be in there. Then what you want to do to add the chest is, I kind of did it the opposite way, so this is now going to be the junk chest on this side. But to add the chest, you want to go to where the hoppers start. And you just want to go like this. Place hoppers just like that, and then you can place a double chest right here. And then make sure that the chest is on the side where the hoppers will flow. As you see, the items will flow this way, and it's the opposite of that side, but they're gonna flow this way. So put the chest right there. And then what you want to do is you want to come around to the back and place a block right here. And you want to take a comparator and place it on the sides on the backs of all these hoppers. And you want to make sure that the light's off just like that. Then you want to cover up the repeaters that you just placed in the ground earlier, just like that. And then simply just cover the rest up with redstone, just like this, and make sure you place it on the ground also. Just like that. And that's the entire machine built. This is your item sorter. It'll now automatically sort the items. So now you, you have to pick the items that you want to sort. So once again, these have to be items that can stack to 64, so we can take like dried kelp, gold, iron, emeralds, diamonds. We'll just take whatever we can get here. And in order to make the machine tell it what you want it to be in each chest, so we want We'll say we want the dried kelp in there, the gold, iron, emeralds, diamonds, and uh, lapis. We'll put it like that. Alright, so for the dried kelp, you want to click on the middle hopper. Make sure it's the middle hopper. And then what you want to do is you want to fill it up with the block that you want it to be. So fill up these four first. And then you want to put 18 in this side right here. And if you check to make sure it's working, if you put in 18 and then if you put in 19, it should drop down to 18. And that's how you know that the machine's working. So once again, in the middle hopper, you just want to keep going throughout. So this one's gold. So we'll put 18 gold blocks in this one, and so on and so forth. Alright, there we go, that's it, that's Lapis, we have 18 just like that. You want to make sure you put them in there individually, don't just throw a stack in there because that could break the machine. So just make sure you do it individually like that and get 18 in each thing. And then you should notice that some of them went through, the extras that I had went through, so they're already automatically sorted. And then that's pretty much your entire build. Now you can just throw whatever items you want in here. We can throw a stack of that, and it'll start sorting the gold. We can throw torches in there, bone meal. Just remember, things that stack to 64, you can throw through here. And yeah, so yeah, you see the gold's collecting right now because the gold's getting taken out in here. We can do this, and now the iron will be starting. And yeah, it just automatically sorts everything. So I just remembered, I forgot to show you guys how to make a garbage chest. So to make a garbage chest, so I don't have one on the end, this is just a lapis that automatically sorted. What you want to do is you just want to go back here and you can just take out all the redstone. And you can just break that torch, you don't need any of that, but just keep the hoppers. And then all the garbage, all the extra stuff will flow into this chest. So if I just go throw some bone meal in here, it'll flow through the whole system. 
and then it'll eventually come out of this chest out here, which is, so remember, it's just the garbage chest, you don't need any redstone for it, it'll just all be at the end of the hoppers, and it'll all flow into this chest, just like that. So that's how you make the garbage chest. But once again, thank you all for watching, it's been Smitty, peace out. Power.